Uh, Shalom, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Wakar Kadash. Double honors to the elders for preaching his word truthfully and sincerely. And Shalom to the Akim, scattered to the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well, too. And I say Shalom. This is the book of Ezekiel, chapter 38, verse 1, and the Holy Scriptures in the reads, And the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Gog in the land of Magog, the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal, and the prophesy against him. Right, so Yah, Bashem al is prophesying against the modern day Russians. But then at the same time, uh, the Heavenly Father is putting that warlike mindset in these uh, Russians. That Cold War uh, warlike mindset in the latter days, you know. Uh, Ezekiel 38 and 3. And thus saith the Lord God, God with thy power. Behold, I am against thee, O God, the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal. Ezekiel 38 and 4. And I will turn thee back and put hooks into thy jaws, and I will bring thee forth in all thy army horse and horsemen, all of them clothed for all sorts of armor, even a great company with bucklers and shields, all of them heavenly swords. Ezekiel 38 and 5. Persia, which is the modern Persia, which is the Iranians, Ethiopia, Kushites, Libya, a North African country, with them, all of them, with shields and helmets. Ezekiel 38 and 6, Gomer, which is the modern day Turk, Turkey, and all his bands, the house of Togomar of the north quarters, and all his bands and many people with thee. Ezekiel 38 and 7, be thou prepared and prepare for thyself. Thou and all thy companies that are assembled unto thee, and be thou a guard unto them. Right, so. These nations that I just named in Ezekiel 38 5 all the way through verse 6. So the modern day Russians, uh, which is Gog in the land of Magog, the Russians are going to be a guard unto these nations. Definitely with the uh, rumors of wars heating up, hostilities and tensions are stirring up between the nations as well, too. So, like I mentioned again, you know, the Heavenly Father is going to put that warlike mindset. And these Russians and these other nations as well, too. And this is a news article we want to bring out. And it kind of correlates a little bit to Ezekiel 38 chapter. And this is a recent news article. Because you were definitely seeing the uh, increasing alliance. And the military alliance as well, too. Between the Russian... Uh, between the Iranians and the Russians as well too so I just want to keep that in mind and this is a uh, and these are the same two countries that are getting hit with hard economic sanctions from the western countries and from the United States as well too and this, this is from the Jerusalem Post this was published by Benjamin uh, Winthaw as of yesterday 1.24 p.m. from msn.com and it reads uh, Iran secures secret secret deal with Russia over uranium for a new program report Iran reached a secret agreement with uh, Russian President Vladimir Putin in July of last year to bypass a future negotiation nuclear deal over its uh, reported in the atomic weapon program enabling Moscow to turn Taiwan's en enrichment uranium according to a media report 
and it says uh, the International Atomic Energy last week said it has located uranium particles at a Iranian underground Fuego site that were enriched to 83.7% purity, which is a near weapons grade uh, material for an atomic weapon. On Sunday, Fox News said it has been told by a foreign intelligence source as part of the agreement between the two countries Russia has undertaken to return all the enrichment uranium to Iran as quickly as possible. If for any reason the U.S. withdraw from the agreement, in response, the United States Department said we will not commit on a proportional security intelligence report by any by in any event the JCPOA has not been the agenda for months. The JCPOA on the abbreviation of the formal name Joint Commonsensual Plan of Action for the atomic deal between the major powers the United States, France, Britain, Germany, China, and Russia. The Iran's regime. So I'm not going to read the rest of all of that. But, you know, as you see, you know, I brought out the Ezekiel 38th chapter. So a Russia is going to be a guard to Iran. While the tensions are definitely stirring up between Iran and Israel, Russia and the United States as well too. And these are the same countries of Russia and China getting hit by hard economic sanctions. Bodies Western and the United States and Israel as well too. As tensions are stirring up. As this recent article as it says, Iran secure secret deal with Russia over uranium for a new program. So definitely wars and rumors of wars heating up. Nations are rising up against nations as well too. It's starting to increase at an all time high. So with that, uh, hopefully this uh, sit down lesson was edifying along with the scriptures that I brought out in reference to this news article. So with that, I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Wakakadash. Uh, double honors to the elders for preaching his word truthfully and sincerely. A shout out one to the Akim, scattered four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well, too. And until next time, I will say, shout out one.